I heard they checking for me, no one checking on me, so I had to go run up a check. I got the message, homie, ain't no flexing on me, my attorney gon' call and collect. Blessings on blessings for me, my successes only made them envious, they got upset. I had to put all their egos in check, you're not entitled to anything else. I got 10 years of this under my belt, your art is an art, they don't feel it and nobody hears it. In Shoulders downhill. There we go. There we go. Oh, nice that's a pick. Nice. Good job, Salazar. Yeah. Nice, nice job. Nice. Turnover Tuesday on Wednesday. Uh, my name is Jason Bourne. I've been the head coach at Saugus uh, since 2003, so this is my 19th season here. Uh, it's my 32nd year of coaching football altogether. You know, as far as winning those five games, including the Football League Championship, you know, our kids had stayed committed through COVID, through the the zoom meetings and uh you know the hard work and commitment that they demonstrated paid off i mean of course there's some confidence coming over but i mean it's a whole new season as you said defense coming back with the 10 players but offense there's a lot of new players a lot of new parts but it's a whole new season we can't look back and say oh we did this last season because it's over like that team won that i think we learned all to be grateful to have a season and to have the five games and i think that it still carries over this season because we don't know what's going to happen with COVID and everything like that so I, everyone's out here practicing hard like it's their last. We have a chip on our shoulder. We have a target on our back. Just want to defend it and uh, make Saugus great. If we don't slam this week, our defensive game plan will not work. So we got to get in that gap. we got to get penetration, create double teams up front, or get in the backfield and make a play. Understood? Sir. Let's go. Get there, get there. Good. Very nice. Very nice. Sebastian Delaire is a returning four-year letterman in our program. Um, He's a wide receiver, defensive back by trade, but this year due to um, you know, some changes that we had to make at the quarterback position, he's actually playing quarterback for us now. And uh, just what an, an outstanding example of a hard worker, committed, um, dedicated to the program, a natural leader who just um, you know, exercises every ounce of positive role model to our kids. I say the hardest thing was learning the run plays. Really, I mean, that, as a receiver, I knew what every player was doing, as you know, what, what route they were running on every play. But just the the mental part of it. I mean, I grew up playing hockey, and that's a very fast-paced game, and that's what quarterback is. It's just making quick decisions at the right time, you know, throwing the ball in the right place. So it's not too far off from hockey playing quarterback. Cody Collier plays defensive back as well as slot receiver for us. He also will play some uh, quarterback as well, and. Cody is one of those young men that just uh, is a dynamic, explosive player. Uh, he understands our defense extremely well. We rely on him to make sure that the coverage on the back half of the defense is uh, all on the same page. Tremendous athlete and hitter on the defensive side. Offensively, outstanding hands. Uh, and just a well-respected member uh, by the other guys on the team. I try my best to make big plays whenever I can. I, I offer many different things on both sides of the ball and just try and compete and make every play that I can. Justin Lee plays offensive and defensive line for us and is the epitome of uh, just a hardworking young man. Uh, he has been in our program for four years. Uh, he can play any position on the offensive line, any position on the defensive line. Uh, he you know, works extremely hard at his craft, very quiet. I don't really like putting my voice out there. I'd like just to do the work and then allow others to follow. Keep running. Leo. So that means the garden tackler pulling left. You got to jab left so that they can pull and then get the ball going right. You just overran both blockers. I know you don't normally do this, but I know you've played running back. So come on. So Braden Salazar uh, came to our program a few years back from our soccer program. And, uh, you know, initially we weren't sure, you know, if he wanted to just be a kicker or, you know, actually play. And once we saw the athleticism that he demonstrated, it became abundantly clear to us that he could be uh, an outstanding wide receiver and defensive back for us. And uh, he hasn't disappointed. I mean, every year he's gotten better and better to the point now where he's a returning all-league uh, defensive back and a pure lockdown corner for us. I mean, uh, teams will deliberately attack the other side of the field just to avoid throwing on his side. And he's one of those kids that just outworks and out hustles everybody else uh, on the field at his position. Uh, I got to work very hard. I mean, I feel like uh, being a corner is one of the hardest positions in the field to do consistently and at a high level. So um, I spent a lot of time on my craft and just a little stuff, and it's got me up to this point. Blake Zimmerman, uh, again, has been in our, in our program for four years. 
Uh, Blake, I know extremely well. Uh, I coached him with my older son who's uh, graduated in youth football. So I've known Blake um, probably uh, just out of diapers until now. And uh, it's been really fun to watch his maturation over the years, uh, not only as a, as a young man, but as a football player. Uh, he's literally the quarterback of our defense. He plays inside linebacker, and he makes sure that everybody's lined up correctly, that guys are in the right spots, guys are going to where they're supposed to go. And he's got a tremendous motor. I mean, he tracks the ball extremely well, and uh, you know, he's in on a lot of plays. Uh, I think it's going to take a lot of grit to go back to back. I know for sure that we've lost a bunch of players, and we've had a bunch of new players stepping into the new positions. And it's, it's going to take them a lot of grit and toughness to get through the adversity that it's going to take to win again. One, two. One, two. Pick it up. Yay! Five, six, family on six. One, two, three. Saugus. Four, five, six. Family.